<laughs> Should be charging much more than that for oral sex. That barely covers your cost of travel. Think. Sorry. Are we live, man? Live. Welcome to episode number 22 of the Marty Michael Fully Actual Podcast. We are in Michael's shithole house and they're kicking us out. We've got two weeks left. We're trying to find somewhere else, but no one else wants us there. So if you have a house to rent in North Brisbane, oh. write it in the comments, okay? And uh, get in touch because he's about to be fucking homeless again. Oh, we'll rent it. Shut up. We'll rent what? The house. Oh, yeah, that, to someone else. No, we'll rent their house. Oh, okay. Sorry. We've got Jaden, Dim, and Austin sitting behind the cameras, everyone. That's right. We've got the boys in today, and they're going to come on later for a little interview about their lives and shit, man. Holy shit. Let's, yeah, that's crazy, man. <laughs> and fucking, we've got a jam-packed episode. we got the boys coming on. we got a Bachelor Brown. We got a prank call. We're gonna continue the to call the lost property as Darren, and Darren's gonna try and describe the fact that he's lost drugs in the lost property, and he wants his drugs back. <coughs> I hope they're still open. Yeah, of course. And of course, we got lying to Lockie, and we got Jaden here, who's going to help us lie to Lockie for this episode, because uh, Lockie is on to us, but he will never suspect Jaden. Oh, especially on a Thursday. Yeah. This is a different day again. Yeah. So, like, have do you know the lie yet? No, we we got to think of one still. No, Come we got it. Oh, what is it again? Yesterday, we're gonna convince. You need to call up. Shh, I can't remember it. <laughs> Shami? Is there something? No, there? Lockie, and say that we need Nigel's number. Ah, oh, that's right. Yeah, the yeah. workplace accident. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna say that. Um, that Austin wants Nigel's number. For to, as a workplace accident, he wants to like sue Shami for a workplace claim, <laughs> and you're gonna ask him for for Nigel's number. That will be the lie. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Anyway, fucking jam packed episode. Holy shit! What a crazy week we've had. Oh man, we fil- today we filmed. We I ate Michael's. We we both ate your. Vomit. We he vomited ice cream we, and he threw it up. We already solved world hunger, so this is like instead of your main course, this is your dessert. You so can just you continue can... to recycle ice cream forever. But the annoying thing is, you do have to constantly throw up. I prefer the corn because you just oh, once you've eaten it, natural. you just sit back yeah. and the food is then made it's more natural, a while yeah, away. It's nice, you know. It's easy. Does that sort of make sense? Yeah, it's a lot. Yeah, yeah. vomiting yeah. ice cream hurts. Yeah. Yeah. How's that different to saliva? Like, how do you freak out more from saliva? It's oh, just they're what, worse than uh, dude, fucking... What there was you some do is not... <laughs> strings? Or what do you call them? Strands. There were some strands today, dude. Oh. Like, proper phlegmy vomit shit that, like, can last forever. You can stretch it, like, three meters and it if stays you want, together. If you want, you can do that. <laughs> that was in an ice cream. Anyway... The, Oh, it'll be taste. on the website, all right? It'll fucking be on the website. The The website video out right now is um, is uh, what was that? And it involves a golden shower. Oh, oh I forgot about that. Yeah, I, I didn't. I didn't forget about that. Anyway. Oh. So that's... that's we, I've been battling this um, fucking... What do you call it? Gastro? Stomach. Is I it still, gastro? This morning, woke up at 6.30, liquid... I sprinted to the toilet and liquid fire jet <laughs> shot out of my ass and painted that bowl oh. a light brown grayish, man. It was <laughs> fucked. And then from 6.30 onwards, just every fucking 15 minutes, go and squirt some liquid shit out of my ass. It's like just It's been like nine days now of diarrhea. Have you lost weight from that? I think, I'd like to think so, yeah. Don't you look at I reckon you have. I've splashed out with a dress for this episode. <laughs> but you are like, you've got a belt. Yeah, yeah, I've got a belt now, so I must be losing weight. Are you feeling... I'm not feeling up? good at all. <laughs> I feel like shit, man. Sorry. We're excited you boys are here. Yeah, look at them all. Yeah. all here. Anyway, that's the shit talk for this week. Let's move right along, eh? So far away. Let's fucking... Oh, by the way, everyone, if you don't fucking know this, and this is just crazy this will change someone's life we are running a competition where if you we're gonna pick one random comment from this entire season to win a thousand dollars which means michael that the more times that you comment 
the more entries into that competition you have. So you'd be have to be a fucking dumbass not to invest a little bit of time writing some comments because it's free money. Fuck off. Do you understand? <laughs> so- <laughs> If you don't want to do that, that's fine. Maybe give us a five-star thing on Spotify or a like or or a comment or a subscribe, okay? That's all. That's all the begging I'm going to do for now. Sponsors now. Oh, fucking sponsors. Go. Goddamn fucking (laughs) manscaped.com. Manscaped.com. They, oh my God, don't even get me started about them. The boys, the boys at Manscaped have got your back literally. They'll shave it for you so you don't get spat on by sluts when they're fucking you. If you want to fuck hard, go to manscaped.com and buy their shit. Use our discount code FULLYACTUAL20 for 20% off. Okay, that's free from us to you. Go and sort your hair issues out and buy some shit from manscaped.com. You filthy pigs. Yuck. They got shit that I ain't even ever seen before, cunt. The ball wipes? Ball wipes because you sweat profusely from your sack and it smells. So and if you want to get sucked off in a cab next to your mate's sister, go to manscaped.com and buy some ball wipes. <laughs> Fuck! Fully actual 20. Manscaped.com. It's oh! a perfect scenario where you with some ball wipes when it come in handy. And of course, the University of Markle, oh. where we post weekly videos. And and to be fair, they're the that they're, they're, you'll never see that kind of content anywhere else. We do some wild shit, Matt Brown. You wouldn't know, cunt. Sorry. Weekly videos are like twenty minutes. They're usually like half an hour long and behind the scenes of our lives. And like we said, there's some fucking gold shit on there, cunt. There's like two hundred and. 20. 15 episodes or some shit now. That's clang. We haven't missed an upload for three years. Shut up, Matt. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> and those are the sponsors. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's everything. That's good. We did all right. it. All right. All right. We're getting through it. All right. All right. Let's all see. Right. On this day. On, on this, this day, day. On this fucking day. What do we got here, eh? Let's see what Matt's come up with with his research. Mm-hmm. This is Matt. Okay. Matt has come up with this and he's given it to me to now read to you guys. Journalism. I, I had nothing to do with this. I have nothing to do with this. It merely comes from my mouth. (laughs) On this day, four years ago, I laid out a fresh meaty shit in my neighbor's front yard. (laughs) Slugs and dung beetles attacked the creamy shit core. My neighbors have never parked me in again, especially because I made them watch me take a shit. Don't fuck with me, cunt. There's layers to me. And you don't want me to peel back my first layer, cunt, because my first layer is the only thing protecting you from me, the real me, Matt Brown. <laughs> Matt, like, just keep it like normal, Shrek. Matt, the on like this Just Sorry. keep it, like, historical, please. So news stories. Got fuck. Layers. That's disgusting. I liked it. Parked you in. No, no, that's respect, can't they? All right. Um, now, moving right along, we've got Michael's Bible now, okay? Now, remember, Michael uh, fancies himself a bit of a god, and he's written a Bible. This is one of these excerpts from his Bible. He's incredibly wise, and during this segment, please refer to him as Bezos instead of Jesus. Chapter 66.5. Ducks can duck and swallows can swallow. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, fuck. Swallows can swallow, but cats can't cat. Fleas can flee and hares have hair, but fish can't fish. Animals are smarter than you think. (laughs) Okay. Don't you think? (laughs) I'm with you. Sorry. Actually, not sorry. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> very, very good, Michael. Very. Oh. D- that one doesn't really relate to my life, but I can see how it's helpful. Yeah. Are, you, are you guys enjoying I mean, I got, this? I got a bit lazy. <laughs> I got yeah, we're just getting all our, our our weird little segments out of the way, and then we'll fucking yeah. This uh, if you guys haven't heard this next segment, 
you're going to be downright disgusted. Oh, yes. What's this next? is this Pinocchio. <laughs> this next oh. fucking segment, everyone. Okay, so the man to my left, Matthew Gregory Brown, has compiled all of his sexual experiences in one black book here. And he has passed me this black book. And I've been reading out um, little entries out of it every week. And <laughs> it's fair to say that it takes a toll on me emotionally. <laughs> Really? Oh, yeah. I, yeah, I really have some vivid dreams now. <laughs> Why so, do you do it then? Thank you for that. Because the people want to hear, man. They want to hear how you got here. They want to hear how the journey you got here. You were fucked, cunt. You were out on the fucking streets, cunt. You were a fucking predator, cunt. But now you're here, cunt, with a baby. Now you're going to have a wife soon too. Oh. That is so true. All right. So as you may remember last week... Uh, Matthew, we left it at Matthew Brown. He had to kill um, Geppetto because he was Geppetto was feeling up Pinocchio, and Matt Brown couldn't stand for that. And Ge- Geppetto is now dead, but they're still inside the whale's stomach. So just so you guys know what's going on, and that's where we left it. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> the baby whale. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Not on behaviour, Matt Brown. But- Anyway. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Excuse me, boys, while I get really into this. <clears throat> Matthew Gregory Brown's Black Book. Have number 58. Ha, 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 rela- relax. <clears throat> <laughs> It was day five inside of this whale, and I'd had a fucking gutful. Pinocchio had been trying to light a fire to make the whale sneeze, but it did not work. I got impatient and squeezed his little fucking wooden throat. Uh, Matt, please! I I can't breathe! You promised me a way out of this whale, Pinocchio. Just as I was deciding whether to snap Pinocchio's neck or not, a giant spear exploded through the whale's stomach, barely missing me. The spear was so massive that it went through the entire length of the whale and stayed lodged inside. The whale began to panic. It swam erratically, thrashing its tail, throwing myself and Pinocchio around like a newborn baby's in a dryer. The whale weakened, and eventually I felt its heart stop beating. Curiously, instead of sinking, the whale began to rise up, almost like something was reeling us in. I'm so scared, Matt Brown! Snap out of it! I slapped him hard to bring him to his senses. Then I slapped him again because it made me feel like God. We were certain the whale was out of the water now and suspended above it. Then the whale suddenly started falling, us included, after a short fall that dropped onto a hard surface. I used Pinocchio to break my fall. Then, after a few moments, a huge blade entered the stomach and began cutting along the side of the whale, and the whale's inside started pouring out, us included. Next thing I know, I'm on my hands and knees, crawling out of the whale's stomach, and the sun is shining, shining on me for the first time in five days. My eyes take a second to adjust, and then, there, standing in front of us staring, were about 40 Japanese men. Whalers. The whale we were inside had been harpooned and caught by Japanese whalers. Pinocchio stood next to me, shaking. Are they... are they friendly? Usually not, no. They might think that we're Greenpeace activists and they might kill us. Stay here and don't move until I tell you to, you little wooden cunt. Pinocchio nervously nodded and I began slowly walking towards the whalers with my hands up. The whalers all took a step back and started speaking nervously amongst themselves. I stopped walking. Hello. I'm Matt Brown. That whale ate us. Please take me and my wooden sex doll home to Australia. There was silence at first. Then one Japanese man stepped forward. We can take you to Australia. But first, you pay money. Damn it. This is going to be harder than I thought. I can pay you when we get to Australia. Now! You pay now or you get off boat! I looked back at Pinocchio. The pussy was shivering like a high-speed vibrator. I didn't have any money. I had nothing. Nothing of value on me. We were fucked. Fucked. Hang on. Fucked. That's it. I'll pay them in fuck. It was a long shot, but I could see a fair few of them checking me out already. I have no money. 
but I can pay in other ways. And as I say it, I undo my pants and they drop to my feet, leaving me standing there in a shirt and undies. The Japanese men murmured to themselves and fell quiet. What do you mean? I was going to have to offer myself to them fully. But first I turned to Pinocchio. Hey, Pinocchio, I want you to watch every single second of this. Don't you dare take your eyes away from me during this. This is your fault, and now I have to do this to save us. Pinocchio nodded sheepishly, didn't say anything, and continued to weep. I turned back towards the Japanese and simply dropped to my knees and slid my shirt off. Then I opened my mouth wide and jingled my man breasts up and down. The Japanese men all looked completely shocked. Then... Suddenly, the 70 or so Japanese men started sprinting in at me, tearing their clothes off as they went. They were all fully erect already, each erect cocked hard but tiny, no bigger than my my thumb. I could sense the electricity in the air from the moment I could see them. They're all out at sea for months on end without even seeing a woman. They have so much lust built up in them that as soon as they saw my white, meaty, pale reddish skin shining in the sun, they became unreasonably horny. I closed my eyes and prepared my mind for what was about to happen. Then bang, a wave of naked, fully erect Japanese men swarmed onto my body like a plague of bees on their queen. Little cocks hammered against my body and worked their way into my anal cavity and I relaxed my jaw as another 20 cocks fought for a spot in my mouth. I was getting ripped and dragged in every direction. Some were biting chunks of flesh off of me. I was fucked up and down and thrashed around. I was tossed and flung and thrown and ripped and torn and bashed. I eventually stopped fighting it. I went with it and arched my back and stretched my ring to allow for some more tiny cocks to drill into it. I sucked their cocks deeply and eagerly, and every now and then I glanced at Pinocchio to make sure he was still watching. He was. I maintained eye contact with him as I sucked one cock to the next, moving quickly through each cock. Suck, 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 suck. Finally, some of the Asian cocks started to pop little cheese strands out. This motivated me, and and I rolled my hips back and forth faster and fucked back at the whalers. Pop, 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 more cheese cheese strands filled my ass and were smeared on my back. Soon enough, all the little whalers had finished with me. My cheese-covered face stared at Pinocchio, and as the last one drilled away at my ass, I minced all over myself. Pinocchio's face was now expressionless, almost like he was dead inside. I was lying on the deck, covered in cheese and totally exhausted. I felt quite filled and sore, but actually quite enjoyed the experience. My first getting a train run on me by Japanese whalers. I dragged myself over to Pinocchio and as I looked into his bloodshot eyes it looked like his soul was dead (laughs) we got to Australia now said one of the Japanese whalers thank you boys I say and exhausted I pass out (laughs) 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 man that's like yeah if that happened to you, man, that's like so sad. <laughs> oh, fuck. That you that had was... to do that. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry you had to go through that. Kumbaya, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Bomb break! You'll love her, dude. You'll love her. She'll 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 be the one you marry, possibly. You already do love her. We're back, by the way. We're back after that bong break. This is going to get awkward. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, uh, No, it's uh, coming. That's the worst bit. All right, guys. She does. Let's uh, let's let's quickly do the uh, screaming segment, guys. We're going to do the screaming segment, and this is where we call any random business and scream as soon as they answer the phone, and we see how long they stay on the phone for. If they stay on the phone for one minute, then we have to say to them, "You win this round." <laughs> yeah, and they will be official <laughs> screaming segment champions. Did last week? Last week was quick. Wasn't last it? week was very quick. Yeah. yeah. All right. Let's let. Who should we prank call? Um, I reckon let's call. Um, what about? I don't know. Sorry. What about a hotel? You won't be able to hear the person. Hello. <laughs> Are you okay? 
Okay. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Who's this? Hello. That was like fucking in the 50s. Oh my God. What was the time? It was like, I think it took him about 10 seconds to answer. I forgot to use an actual timer, but it was at about a minute and five seconds. I was going to say the saying oh. five seconds later. Oh, five seconds off. Very, oh, shit, very good. That was close. Very, very wow. good. We're getting them. <laughs> <laughs> what about the first sentence? Yeah, are you yeah. okay? Yeah, the- yeah are you okay? <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, it's just someone screaming. <laughs> I heard someone say. <laughs> oh. <laughs> is that illegal? Oh, man. Is, that, is me doing that illegal? Surely not. No way. You look so happy in your non ergonomics chair. This is a one off. Very good. Man, a one off. I I've, haven't I've felt more comfortable. Like the ergonomics chair is really good, but this is quite nice. Yeah, Matt. It's a special treat. It's not on. Sorry. It's not on, brother. All right, so we've done the screaming segment. Now it's time for Bachelor Brown. Yeah, if you want. I'm, I'm nervous. Oh, oh, this oh, 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 I want. I want. Bachelor Brown will be. Oh. Hmm. All right, guys, it is time for Bachelor Brown. Bachelor Brown. Bachelor Brown. He's right behind you. He's right fucking behind you. And this is a segment where Michael and I, we go out into the streets and we find potential partners for Matt. You didn't even find this one. And we call them and set up a phone date for him. Every week, a new a new woman. And he's talking to some, he's been on dates with some. It's working. Are you still talking to the girl from last week? Isla? Which is everyone's helped with with Isla? Are you still talking to Isla? I've messaged a couple of times. How that. often do you guys talk? Nothing. We just send funny things. Have to you each signed other up right to OnlyFans? No. You have. No. He fucking has. <laughs> you fucking have. <laughs> you fucking has, all right? I thought you pulled the knife out. Yeah. So I, like, I wish I did, eh? <laughs> I wish I Ooh. did. No, I'm not going to sign up to her only. What about um, the, the um, English one? Yeah, the other one. I haven't signed up to her only fans. No, I, no, but are you talking to her? Yeah, she, me and her get along pretty well, but we've just been talking about random shit. Yeah, so, yeah, that's what you do when you first start to get to know someone. Yeah, I know, but know she's know I mean? in England. Yeah, I know. Look, there's distance there, but if it's meant to be, it's meant to be. And Bachelor Brown, 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 he has been calm and charismatic during these calls. I'm nervous with this one. He's been so confident. I don't know. And just been shining absolute Where's this one from? Yeah, see, there's no background. Gold Coast. Kazakhstan. That's close. She's from Kazakhstan. But she's in the Gold Coast. Look, I don't, like I don't know where she's from. Year, Look, and that's right. Let, let's not speculate. You can ask her your fucking self, okay? It's a normal question asked. Does she actually. Oh, just anyway, me. so, Mark, Loves like you. I said, Michael and I, we found another eligible bachelor for Matt Brown to, to speak to, okay? Matt, as soon as we call, we'll leave it to you. Pretend like we're not even here. We'll might give, drop some little hints here and there. Oh, you will. But you won't even know the way You do here. drop hints. All right, here we you go. You don't be quiet. That's the problem. All right, here we no, go. We'll help. We, we'll be a bit quiet this time. Yeah, it's ringing. Sort of. Oh my God, it's ringing, Matt. Shh, 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 Matt. Don't so, fuck this up, What the fuck? He, look at Austin's reaction. <laughs> don't fuck Austin's, this up. Hey, Austin's fucking hey, throwing me under the bus. Play hard to get on this one. She's not going to answer. I win. Oh damn! Oh well. All right, Maybe guys. She look, she has might a yoga class. We, we'll table Bachelor Brown for now. We might, we might come back to it. Brown, it is our responsibility. Oh, she's calling. Oh, all right, sweet. All right, let's fucking. Out of it. Yes, she's calling. Unlucky me, still brown, brown, brown. She could be brown. the one that you marry. No, she's not because there's just I, I can't, I can't trust you. Show me your click. 
Oh, very, very. Oh, mine's a weak as shit, man. Get He's it in the there. Lock it. it in. Lock it in. All right, here we go. All right, we got the green light. Austin set it oh. up. He's her pimp. I don't like the way your reaction was when it first started ringing. You guys can't hear it. All right, it. here we go, Matt. Hey, get in the fucking zone. Don't fuck this up, Brown! Hello. Hey, is this um, Bridget? Hey, yeah, it is. Yeah, uh-huh. look, it's uh, Marty and Michael here, and you were on the um, world's biggest and best podcast or some shit, fully actual. And sitting with us, we have a very eligible uh, single man in his late... Or early forties, let's say early forties. Fucking thirty five. He sits on strange <laughs> chairs, and and you know he's single at the moment, but he's not a bad guy. And he, we've just want to give him the opportunity to just see, talk to you, Bridget, and just get to know you a little bit, and maybe see if there's some potential there for like something future, something future you two two together. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. Well, he can always slide into my DMs. If uh, he really oh, wants to. we love sliding, sliding into sliding into DMs. Lo- anyway, I'll well, throw it over to Matt, and don't worry. He'll carry the conversation. He's very good at this. Just relax and let him do all of the heavy lifting. Try and kiss her. Matt. Try and kiss her. Just on. straight up kiss her. Surprise her with a kiss. Say something. Far hey, too kiss. long. Kiss Far her. too long, Matt. Stop. Um, Bridget, what are you doing coming on this? What were you thinking? Um, well, you know, I've just been looking for, um, looking for a decent guy, you know, and I was given the opportunity to take this phone call and... You guys are just kind of throwing one in my lap, so I thought, why the fuck not? Oh, I feel I feel like you've been forced to come on, no, Matt. Come on, change the up, fucking subject. Right change now. your fucking subject, mate. Talk, talk to her about Matt. something with substance. Uh, uh, where are you from? Yeah, that's the shit. Um, I'm from Gold Coast, <laughs> Australia. Whereabouts on the Gold Coast are you from? You know, that's a bit stalkerish. Ah, he's been caught. He's been caught out <laughs> trying to locate her address. Oh, God. Don't ask for her address on the second oh, question. Get to know her brain. Get to know who she is as a person, Matt Brown. Bridget, ask her what her favourite colour is. Yeah. What's your favourite colour, Bridget? Oh, it's so boring, though. Oh. Um, my favourite colour would have to be baby blue. <gasps> He's actually baby holding blue. a blue baby right now! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that God, is mystic is. sign. Yeah, wow, that oh, is shit. Wow, a baby blue baby. Would you say she's top three now, Matt? Maybe. I have no idea what she... Why don't you tell her, tell her your hobbies? Tell, tell Bridget what your hobbies are. And what no, your actually, it doesn't matter about me. No. Bridget, what are your hobbies? What are my hobbies? Yeah, what do you like to do for fun? Hmm. That's a good question. Um, I like to party. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty good at it. Well, Matt loves a um, party. Like my love, I love a yacht party. So if you have a yacht, that'd be mad. Oh, okay. You, you were talking about maybe buying a yacht in, in like 50 years. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, see, that's just not good. Um, um, I love watching TV and I'm a mad stoner. Oh, Brown. Right. You love TV as well. Yeah, TV. And you is, could get into I weed. I have a TV. You could get into weed. Yeah, of that's, course. All right. Things are going well. What's your favorite TV show? Well, right now I'm watching Supernatural. I'm oh, having a okay. Lot of fun. What do you have to? Can you, do you know any like bits of trivia about that show or something? Come on, impress her, impress her here, Matt. Here's oh, your chance. I don't know they've got. Here's your chance. They're, they're brothers. He's, Fucked it. Fucked it up. That's Fucked. it. Oh my god, I can't believe you know what someone watching. Pretend, yes, she's pretending. And their dad dies, and they're trying to. Def- I don't know. Oh, yes, something like that. So I can't remember. Yeah. Oh my god, Matt. Yeah, yeah. Fucking, the Winchester brothers. That's it. One of the lead guys' name. <sighs> something. Can't remember. Bridget, can you see a future with Matt Brown? Oh, she's never even seen me. She's Why does forced. that matter, Brown? She's been forced. Haven't to come you ever on seen here. the show Blind Love, where there's a fucking war between them and they get to know each other? Oh, it never works out. Yeah, no, it does. It does far better than the looking of the Instagrams. All right. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, I say, into the soul. I say, you two exchange phone numbers, right? No, no, and we then, do. We and, then, and, no, then, we... and then you text each other first without even looking at each other's Instagram for maybe I'm going to say two months. Get to know each other. Two months. <laughs> two months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two yeah, months. I'm a, and I'm a bit vain. I don't know if I'll be able to do that. Uh, oh, Matt, She's you're going to have to vain. get... You know, That's fair. You're going to have to change yourself to meet that need. <laughs> <laughs> um, Bridget. Um, now, oh, what kiss. do I usually ask? Lean in for a kiss, Matt. Now. Don't hiss, Matt. Sorry. Don't hiss. <laughs> um, Bridget, how old are you? I am at 24. Okay. 
Guess how old Matt Brown is. I'm a little bit older 39? than you. 35. 35. 35. So, yeah, yeah so that, that, that is a little bit of an age gap. That is a bit of an age gap. But that means you have more money, so that's fine. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, my brown. Oh, he's strangling that baby on his chest. Brown. 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 Oh, my brown. <laughs> Bridget, thank you so much for coming on. Um, look, I'm, I'm going to give Matt your Instagram. Is that okay? So if you get That's a so if you if you get a That's DM awful. if you get a DM from Matt Brown one 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 one. I know four That's ones. Terrible. Fucking fuck. One 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 one. Yeah, so yeah, four ones. He, the out. first DM will probably be what is your location? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so just ignore that. <laughs> But he's going to message you and, um, yeah, look, let's see what happens here. If we're, By the way, the final, the top three girls that Matt has loved yeah, no, the most. No, we're not doing this. This season. We're not going to do this. Inviting private jet. Them, they get a private jet to Brisbane that, and all expenses paid, <laughs> staying in a five-star hotel, the best sort hotel of. in Brisbane. Something like oh, that. Oh, that's awesome. Fuck yeah. yeah. So, so well, you I'm know, if you can... Slide, 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 slide the end, buddy. Yeah, so if you can charm him enough and you make that top three, you know, at the very least, it's a, it's a you've made a great friend and you've... And you've you've gotten yourself a lovely evening, uh, paid well, for. <laughs> anyway, Bridget, thanks so much um, for coming on, and thank you for coming on, Bridget. Have a great night. Bye, bye, Bridget. Bye, Come Bridget. Bye. Give it a kiss. Lean in for a kiss. Lean in for a kiss, Matt. Matt's kissing the microphone. Oh, oh whoa, 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 whoa! God, that whoa. worked. Whoa, it don't work. Whoa, I felt that. That worked. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Bridget. See you guys. Bye. Oh my god. Okay, oh, so that's whoa, man. That was that special. took a turn. That, that was, was like four kisses, five, six. Sorry, she was kissing, of. and he was kissing as well. Like, did you hear that? So they pretty much just hooked up the first date, and you don't even know what she looks like. She doesn't have any arms, and that all came from a hiss. She you has no well. arms, Matt. So how do you feel now? Hmm? Yeah, that's all right. I'll go no arms. Yeah, I, I bet you would. Easier to to handle. <laughs> Aren't they? Ah, oh, easier to round up. You just push them a bit on one shoulder, and they can't uh, balance themselves. They're fucking top heavy, and they stumble around. They're falling. They got nothing to break their fall with. They have to accept it. <laughs> just accept with it. Oh, she sounded nice. Oh. Yeah, well, she's not, Matt. Sounded like a lovely person. She's. Was she special at clear fishing in it? What have you set me up here with? Because I'm s- <laughs> no. She's she was at um she was at Jackson's parties. Yeah, what stuff? She? Bridget, yeah. Bridget, no idea. Yeah. Anyway, that is Bachelor oh, Brown. Her then. Um. So if you want to thank us, Matt, feel free. That's Clap the end of that for us. You're welcome. You're so welcome. Oh. All right, guys. Moving right along, and now we are going to go with. The lying to Lachlan oh, segment. Yeah. Oh, should we bring the boys on. Yeah, then, yeah, Mike? that's what yeah. I mean. Yeah, I'm okay, going to introduce cool. them yeah. at the same right. time. And playing along this week to help us lie to Lockie is going to be Jaden and Austin. So the boys are going to come on over, and then we're going to call Lockie and lie to that fucking <laughs> little gullible <laughs> fuck. <laughs> we're going to get yeah. Got All right, guys, J- uh, welcome to the set, Jaden and Austin. <laughs> come on over, boys. Uh, how do we want to? Come on. Um, yeah, chuck them on. Chuck them on. It just makes things easier to hear. You see that? Yeah, cheers, yeah, mate. It's crystal. It's crystal yeah, clear. Man. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> All right. Sorry. Here we have the voice. Look, we haven't had guests on for so long. It's so strange yeah. that not Matt there. Hopefully, we have four mics. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we're I'm excited. Today. We're growing up. We like Get out of the shot, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fuck. All right, boys. Now, we'll have a chat to you after this, but it's very important that we lie to Lachlan this week. He's not going to suspect that you're, you... He doesn't know you guys are here. Great he? idea. So what? So this is what... So, Jaden, just so you understand, okay, so you'll call Lachlan and be like, oh, hey, man, do you have Nigel Munt's... Can I just get Nigel Munt's number off you? Is that okay? Yeah, yeah. And then if he asks, oh, yeah, sure, what for? Then you can say, oh... It's just Austin's like, um, it's just some legal issues with um, his his recent back injury. Just filming for Charmy. And I reckon we chuck, we chuck. When he asks how is Dubai, you say Dim got Lyme's disease. 
Yep. What's up? <laughs> What's up? It's just like this disease Chucking where you can't like lives. live properly yeah. anymore. Double oh, life. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but like only does. only say that if he asks oh, how he's really? Dubai. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> does he actually have Lyme disease? So. He's a weird dude. Hey? Does he have Lyme? Oh, he's strange. He's just strange. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Yeah, he just left without saying goodbye. Yeah. That's oh weird. yeah, it's because of his Lyme's disease. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It makes you leave. Yeah. Liming. Sorry. He's coughing up limes outside. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's oh, what that is. I reckon he'll fall for it. Right? <laughs> yeah. And then yeah. as soon as he's like, oh, really? Like, a- agrees to anything that you've said, that's when we all come in, like, you fucking idiot. Yeah, you've yeah, yeah. been lied to. You've been lied to. And then just hook in. And then oh, we're so yeah, going to try and hurt his You're going to come in as that. soon as he, like, yeah, yeah, like we've got you, you uh, idiot. Really yeah, talk so low What if he it? doesn't ask? What, why do you need it? Um, yeah, yeah. What if okay, he just so says, yeah, bro, I'll send it to you. And that's it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, um, then then be like, oh, then just, oh, hey, you've been Do you want to know yeah, what yeah. happened? Just yeah. say that over and over again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And if he asked how Dubai was, yeah, just say it was like something, it was shit. Yeah, or- yeah. I'll make a natural at the start. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do I call? Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, I'm is putting there another speaker? lie we can add in on this can to you take it really far? Thing? Yeah, yeah. So put Throw it in and then just hold the phone up to the mic and then we can all fucking fuck it. <laughs> Throw in the fact that what's something else that you can go really far with it if he catches both of those? Let's think big here. Let's say that you've found out how to go back in time or something. <laughs> no, he won't believe it. <laughs> Let's just no, throw Jay's, that out he's there. He's joining the army. <laughs> Jay's joining the army. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah, fuck yeah. it. I don't know if it'll work, but, but yeah, that's after a one, a one yeah, success. Yeah, let's yeah, get him. Right. No, let's first. Go, oh, we'll get let's the, get him hooked on an ally first. He wants weird, bigger. Yeah, he wants I reckon that you are a fucking. You've been getting scratches on your back from ghosts at night. So you wake up in the morning <laughs> and there's scratches no, on your back. Well, let's 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 get the win first though yeah. with a little light. <laughs> this is what's been happening at night. There's nothing there. I can't see oh. shit, dude. Okay. Oh, I see. No, that's just it's from an absolute sticks. freak show. I know yeah. what you're about. I know what you're about. All right, so let's get him with a little eye and then we'll let you keep going yeah, and yeah. make it a bit bigger. And then we'll, if he catches on, then we'll fucking come in. Yeah. Fucking, um, fucking lucky. Hello, mate. Yo, bros, what's been happening? Not much, man. What are you doing? Oh, just cruising, eh? Just cruising. What are you up to? I'm just fucking at home. Better go to gym with Scott. Oh, true. Oh, is this Scott's birthday? Yeah, hey, uh, when was it yesterday? Oh, yeah, sweet. Tell him I said happy birthday. Um, just a, just a quick one then. I won't keep you too long. Um, mm-hmm. Do you have Nigel's number? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you reckon I could have it? You be a good accident, mate. Nah, fucking... Aussie's having some problems with fucking Shami and his back oh, problems. So, yeah, a bit of legal issues. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He does that stuff. Oh, perfect. Right, Bro, if Austin said that he couldn't return to work, you can make so much money. Because when you have a super superannuation, um, there's like an insurance on it. And if you can't continue to contribute to your superannuation, you get like this huge payout, like fucking... Oh, like get a couple fucked. Hundred, a couple hundred thousand dollars. But you have to like, obviously he broke his fucking thing. But if he can't like continue to do his job anymore, there's like insurance on your superannuation that people don't know about. True. Or TP declam. Fuck. Bro, so this could be a big like, one, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Fuck, that's hectic. Yeah, right. All right, send that through. Yeah, um, send it to you. Yeah, sweet. Cheers. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you got lied to, Lucky. <laughs> Fuck you. That was a lie. Jaden doesn't need Nigel's number, oh, Lucky. You You've been lied to. You've been lied to, Lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fuck that was good. That's the second lie. Was it that's that's scratched by a penguin, wasn't Talk about talk about Dubai. Oh, how was Dubai anyway? Because um, Dim came back with Lyme's disease, eh? <laughs> no, wait, on a real note, you know Dim? He's... No, no, fuck this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I actually wanted to tell you something serious. <laughs> Do you want to know or no? Yeah, wait, I'll 
want to hear it, but I don't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, like on a serious note, Dim came back from Abu Dhabi with Lyme's disease. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't believe it. I don't know nah, like dead set, bro. Dead it. set. This is fuck. <laughs> What's Lyme's disease? Where he just goes black. Like he means nothing. Lime. Anymore. Yeah. Lime. <laughs> Limes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, we got you again, man. And uh, that's, just, that's just how how it happens, man. We'll always be lying to you. You won't ever know until the lie is complete, cunt. That was a very good one. I did not expect that. <laughs> Bro, you full started going deep into it. You're like, man, you could get so much. You're going to get fucking rich. <laughs> oh. Oh, very uh, good. Right. Anyway, so, sorry for wasting <laughs> your time again, cunt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, so oh, fucking well good. done. Yeah. That well was done, very Jamie. good. Well done. Yeah, he fully believed that immediately. Yeah. <laughs> we can we use other people to lie. Yeah. That's what we need to do. Moving forward. Matt tries nah. Matt. Nah, he'll know, Matt. He'll have to be can't even be James. We'll literally have to contact his dad. If we could get- Let's contact his dad to lie to him. <laughs> Isla. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That could work. Or Jackson. Yeah. We'll get them to call and- rec- uh. right. Yeah. Anyway, it's going to be great. Anyway, look at who we have, everyone. It's Jaden and Austin, everyone. Holy shit. What the fuck? We have guests on our show. Oh, yep. What's been going on, my friends? <laughs> fuck. We don't work together anymore. Yeah, I know. Yeah, no. yeah. So we just live together. Weird. That's about yeah. it. So what's, what do your days consist of now, Jaden? You got the fucking... Where are the... Can you bring over the meals, Maddie? <laughs> that's Eyeing all I, them that's off. That's all I had in the fridge left, eh? <sighs> but yeah, macro kitchen. Just like online food. How's that going? Is it fucking... Yeah, I've had them. They're, they're delicious. Yeah, yeah. Good, yeah, yeah. eh? Yeah, they are very so good. Every day. Yeah. yeah. So macro kitchen. So what if people want to get w- w- like what? Just their meals yeah, prepared for them? Yeah, yeah. They're pretty health specific. There's a few like um, unhealthy ones, but we're actually about to launch another one. I can't say the name yet, but we're doing another one, which will be a lot more exciting. Okay. <laughs> fuck yeah. But no, yeah, it's good. Good stuff. Get around it. Um. So what? Macrokitchen.com. Dot au. Yeah. Okay, fuck yeah, there you go. If you want some homemade healthy meals, handmade by Jaden himself <laughs> every day, macrokitchen.com.au. And what about you, fucking Austin? You had your fucking yep. back I fucked up. snapped. I fucked oh, up. Oh, yes. Yeah. Dude, no talk us through that. That would have been, did you know straight away something was wrong? Yeah. Because like, I did saw you hear it sounds? straight away. Did you hear nah, sounds? because I was underwater. Oh man, I watched it and like, and we've screen recorded it and put it on our website. So if you want to watch it, it's on our website. No, I'm just kidding. It's on Sh- Shami Uncut. And, and it, it was so hard to watch, oh, especially because after, because yeah. you know your back's broken yeah. and you're like walking around and shit. And you just, just fucking sit yeah, down, cunt. As soon yeah, as did they the say host- that did more damage? Nah. Could have, though, right? I went to the hospital, they started blowing up at me. Because I said no to an ambulance. I was like, get my mate to drive me there and everything. And they're like, that's the worst thing you could possibly do. And I was like, ah, oh, fuck, true. Oh. So what was it exactly? Like Fractured a- vertebrae. So, and oh. then like herniated discs and everything. It was fucked. It was bad. It was like 10 out of 10 pain. Maybe not for you guys, but for me, 10 out of 10. Oh, no. Back shit's <laughs> fucked. No, back yeah. Shit's yeah so it was his bad. breathing afterwards that really. Yeah, yeah, like his breath was taken away. It felt like yeah. someone was just stabbed me with knives in the back. It was hectic. Oh, man. That was oh, fucked. Oh, fuck. It was so bad. You're just man. walking around. <laughs> <laughs> trying to like That's walk so it dumb. off a bit. <laughs> it so- oh, yeah. It was rough. It was rough to watch. Yeah. Like, but the recovery oh. wasn't too bad. It was only like. Five weeks I was out? Nah, longer. Like seven, eight. What does oh, out mean? Like lying now. down? Ten now. I've been back at work for like three or four weeks. Oh, wow. And what? So yeah. you had to just lie down? Yeah, I just <laughs> literally... Bro, I was <laughs> laying in hospital. I was laying in hospital. They couldn't do an MRI on me for like a day and a half. So I was just lying here like this, looking up at the ceiling. Oh. Not, a, not allowed to move a fucking muscle. So you can't even watch TV? No, I couldn't do anything. Oh, I, my God. Fuck. Whoa. For me to piss, they had to log roll me onto the side. Nurses had to hold my fucking, the cup over my cock. Oh, that so would have been fuck. so embarrassing because you would have been not hard at all. You fright like a yeah. motherfucker too. Your dick would have been small. Yeah, my yeah. dick would have been so tiny like just because you're in pain. Exactly. And your dick goes small when yeah. you're in pain. <laughs> That's <laughs> it. All the blood's <laughs> redirected around. Yeah. Come. You How many days was it like that? Oh, uh, until I got my MRI, so a day and a half. And then I was allowed to move my neck because my neck was cleared, but it was pretty oh, fun. But I'm Jesus. sweet now. And so what now? You're back to normal? Yeah, go to Europe next weekend. So, so you don't have, so you're literally 100% recovered uh, now? Yeah. Oh, close. I wouldn't say so you could do, like, I still do, do that yeah, yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, I can move. Wow. Fuck. 
how much would it cost for us to like pay you to, to do that attempt, again? I know. I, <laughs> attempt to do a backhand on the couch. I remember no. I've been on benders Bro, with yeah. you, Boy, and yeah. you have just pulled out backflips. Oh yeah, yeah. Dude, it's you because didn't no, that, right? it's because oh of this fucking Justin's open. <laughs> yeah, judge it. Oh, no, it's because oh of him. But he goes up and just nails a backflip, and then in my head I go, I can fucking do that. Yeah, it does look easy, it's eh? Yeah, yeah. So I've just copied him and just oh, do the man. right rotation. Dude, you could have done the same thing on oh, them. I reckon yeah. that was worse than the fucking jump. I'm so, yeah. I think really? I learned my lesson. I think I'm dumb. Nah, backflip. third time yeah. lucky. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna, I think I'm Surely don't front give up. <laughs> You're so close. Yeah. Front oh, flips man. are the new one, I think. I'll give it 10. But backflips are done. Yeah, so, yeah, fucking hell, man. The that was there. hectic as yeah. shit. That was some, like, even even just seeing how oh. deep the water was. Is that one of those things you look back and go, I can't believe it was so fucking yeah. dumb? Yeah, and like three people went before me and they're like, oh, fuck, it's real shallow. Yeah, and I've just oh so much confidence going into it, but yeah. oh yeah, dude, uh, I was I, so confident. Did you ever think you might land on your Not head once? That was the problem. Well, did you think you were gonna I fully nail that? Fully if you had a bit more height, you you probably would have gotten just close. Fucking more rotation just or something. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Just didn't try anything. You just, <laughs> just looked up and that was it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah. Lesson oh learned, my god! That's, a good lesson learned. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's definitely, I don't know how you guys got out of fucking. Well, we've we've, some things, things, we've like dialed we it back have. a bit. Like, well, the nail gun thing, we look back and cringe. Yeah. I was like, I, that yeah, was that was that's that was, over because that actually hits your spine. You'll dude. Yeah, yeah I, know, I never thought of that for some reason. It's like insane. Oh, oh. And like one went in between our heads. And we didn't get told that until after. Oh, our film was like one of the nails, like just went. We were standing shoulder to shoulder. One of the nails went in between our heads. Oh man, no, that no. would have oh, fucked. Fuck. What, you would have died if it. I don't know. Yeah. Depends oh, where. If it, it just probably would have taken well, it the ear off. It went then. this far into my car. Oh, and imagine oh, the back of the neck. Oh fuck, fuck, fuck. fuck, fuck. Oh, oh man, you just see the end of it come out of the your, your fucking oh. Adam's apple cunt. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh man, silly that been Billy. Yeah. Content. <laughs> content. <laughs> yeah, no, great, great work. So, are you going to do any of the social media shit anymore? Because you guys, you guys are going to you going to Europe as well. Nah, I'm not. I'm not going. But these boys are. Yeah. yeah. What country are you going to first? Um, we're going to Barcelona first. Oh wow, it's beautiful. Have you yeah, been cool to place. Europe yet? No. Nah. Yeah, man, you're gonna have a good time. I'm fucking keen, eh? Yeah, fuck. There's so My many like hurt, but so many sketchy, sketchy drug dealers like on every corner, and they yeah, all know. That's they what we know. Every for, alleyway. Yeah. yeah. And, oh, come here, man. Yeah. It'll be and inspiring. always listen to them. Our advice is always listen to <laughs> them and always go with them. <laughs> well, how old are you now, Austin? Twenty five now. Yeah. Wow. Mm. So like Europe, here you come. First time going to Europe, right? Yeah. Yeah. How long oh. are you guys doing? A month. A month, but we might stay longer. Fuck yeah. me. Fuck, we probably will stay longer. Did you almost die in Europe? Any time. That's oh, yeah. True. That's what I'm worried about, eh? Yeah. Like, well, we were all so dumb back then, but yeah, we got arrested. We're and not too smart either, though. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> the spine. <laughs> he <laughs> fucked his <laughs> spine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but these guns back in there. Yeah, don't true. Fuck. <laughs> fuck, I still remember those fuck. benders at San Simeon. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. Wow, it got so silly. Oh my god. Yeah, dude, that was even the very bang. first day I met you, and he's just. Can I say? Yeah. <laughs> the very first time I met you, he's brought that big bag of MD. Yeah. And we just bend it in Brizzy. Oh, and that's Shami's right. first house. Shami's yeah. Big. Oh, that's right. Like yeah. A, oh, yeah. no, I met you at the pub first. Yeah, that was, but that's still we got hammered drunk. <laughs> yeah, and like played <laughs> pool for ages, yeah, yeah. and it turned into like. Remember Jashan's um, shoe shop opening? <laughs> yes, and you, fucking you, we got fucked up walking down night. the stairs in your fucking undies, and there's like everyone's Man. family there. <laughs> that's right. And he's doing that dance. <laughs> Man, we almost missed it. <laughs> oh, that's it yeah, so yeah. Because we passed out, and then Pera just came, like banging on the door and woke us all up like half hour late. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Yeah, because the night before Zanny, we were Zanny. fucked as well. <laughs> yeah. Zanny's, man. Oh my god, oh, not good. Yeah, the 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 New Year's the Eve parties at Charmy's was so fun. Those oh. fucking two years. Oh my god, <laughs> Marty was just ripping his clothes off, and he just had a little bit of undies covering. <laughs> Every time I stepped. <laughs> I stepped forward, you could see my dick and ball. And I had so many people like being so disgusted because well, no one really knew who we were at that no, stage. And, and people full of like family friends. Literally, <laughs> whole family was, like, was there. Mom, yeah, dad, family friends for like thirty years. Flashing my dick every step forward I take, and people just looking at me, shaking their heads, and like, oh, is that that guy with oh the dick God. out? <laughs> I 
never just I literally just be so so, yeah. so munted at some points in the night and then I'd look over and see you amongst this group everyone's just normal and you're just in this tattered rag <laughs> just so fucked oh, oh, like oh, oh. Fuck oh. me, dude. Oh, wow. And yeah. by the morning time, with especially with the MD nights, man, oh. he would just be, he would just, Michael would just, yeah, th- oh. there's no talking to him. He'd just say random sentences yeah, and then the piss himself. Yeah, I was about to and say. And drink it. Every, yeah. No, every time we'd walk outside, like the next morning, there'd be a mattress just laying in the sun <laughs> yeah. with a massive piss stain. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh. Michael would be lying oh, on it with Michael. a tall in his fist. Oh, yeah. I remember one time... I I actually like pissed on the mattress outside and passed out and I got so sunburnt. <laughs> like my whole back, like you could pull sheets off. Oh, it was the, the worst. the one next to Kayla? Yeah, the one next to Kayla. Kayla. You pissed next to him and he woke up dread. And he go, wait. And he woke up going, fuck, it's hot, eh? I'm sweaty as. Sweaty as. Oh, no. And then when he found out, he was, oh, fuck. <laughs> What was he like? He was going oh, skits with him. He's like the last person you want to piss on. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. He's, I he's apologize. You don't even man. fucking oh. remember that. <laughs> I apologize. But, uh, oh. oh, man. <laughs> yeah, fucking hell. So social media, eh? Yeah, fun time. What, what's the plan? What, what do you, what do you, like, what do you want to, where are you going to be in five years, Fox Austin? Man. Like, are you just going to keep fucking, because like, sure. well, look at your, the, like, the fun you guys have and man, it's pretty fun. Yeah. Like now that we're traveling as well, like it's fucking sick. Yeah. But like, I remember, yeah, at that age, it was so fun. And then you get to your late twenties and your early thirties and it quickly turns into <laughs> a fucking problem. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's becoming a problem. It's, yeah. It's already becoming a problem. Man, it's becoming a problem. Yeah. Yeah. So like, so you have no. Have more. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing We always have too much yeah. fun like, yeah. So much it fun It is a lot of yeah. fun eh? Fucking wild shit Let's get fucked up Yeah Bong yeah. Bong yeah. break <laughs> <laughs> Very agile to get through there. Very good. Sorry, and we're back. Thank we were you. talking while we were smashing bong after bong after bong. There was a time when Michael pissed himself next to me. And he had a uh, morning glory. So his piss was angled up. So like his dick was angled up towards me and um, pissed all over my chest and upper body. <laughs> I've been pissed on by Michael <laughs> maybe 10 times. Maybe 10 times. Sorry, dude. <laughs> Every time we drank, there would be piss on me the next morning. Oh, come and have a party. <laughs> yeah, so we'll come and be pissed on. Do you remember the time <laughs> that you banged on your door? Oh, that was fucked. One time Michael had fucking passed out up at the penthouse where we used to live. And I was just banging on the door like for fucking half an hour because he was passed out on the bed. And, and I knew he would have fucking pissed, but he was wearing an adult nip- an adult diaper. So I was like, oh, surely it'll be okay. Banging about all the neighbors coming out. Is everything all right? And I was like, yes, I just need to get into my fucking room. Then finally, fuckwit wakes up, comes to the door. His diaper is overflowing with urine. <laughs> And I looked at the bed and there's piss. It's like, it's just may as well have not worn a diaper. There needs to be an adult diaper though. On a seriously, on a serious note, they need to make a better adult diaper. Because that would did nothing, cunt. Yeah, well, it's for poos, I think. Yeah, but like even, because I've been wearing one to bed. Because I haven't want to shit the bed. Because I shit the bed last week because of my diarrhea. So I've been wearing one. Every now and then I feel a bit queasy and I put one on. And like, I don't off- feel it offers much protection. If there's a squirt while I'm sleeping, that'll seep out the sides for sure, cunt. Yeah, well, like, piss, so it was never, normal. ever meant to stop. Well, it's only recent that I've wa- ever worn an adult diaper, like, out of, like, like because I, I need to. It's the first time. <laughs> but yeah. I reckon- do they, what do they look like? They They're just, just like-, like, like normal diapers, but just bigger. They need like they need to be more like undies, so they catch the stuff out the sides. 
Should have invested Fuck. in a, like a mattress so protector. Fun. Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. I can't believe we're talking about Anyway, this. sorry about that. We got a bit off track. <laughs> Fucking Jaden and Austin come. <laughs> how's your love life, boys? How's 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 um how's that going? No love life, eh? Hey. Yeah, none for me either. You just slam and slags. <laughs> no, no. no, we're good boys. Don't do it. <laughs> oh, thank you. Sorry about <laughs> that. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we'll move on to um, some questions. All right, fuck comment of the week this week. Can have a fucking week off. Can be oh. fucked explaining it. Um, all right, so this is we're going to answer some questions that you guys have commented on the Muddy Mock or Fully Actual YouTube channel and that we answer the most liked questions first, okay? So if you want us to answer your question, comment a question and have a scroll through and like some of the other questions that you want us to answer, cunt. Comment. Lots of comments. Oh, we love comments, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> anyway. So Are you ready? ready? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um, we're all so uh, Top question now. went to Joe. Oh, how do I say that? <laughs> do you want to say that so one? High, I'm really bad with the names. Uh, Jar and Kingston. Um, and his question was, um, can we get a Bachelor Woods after we finish with a Bachelor Brown? Oh, uh, with Julian? I don't yeah. know. I feel like... With um, Julian, I don't think Julian would do it. I think if we gave that much... Opportunity to Julian, he'd probably end up in jail. <laughs> <laughs> he'd get arrested for something. I don't know what yet, but he would get arrested for something. So probably not. Maybe in like ten years' time, when he's when he's settled down a little bit, maybe th <laughs> maybe then we will take up that job. We take it very seriously. <laughs> We'd really want Matt to stop being so lonely and sad. Aww. We're good at it. We're so good at it. You anyway. found the one, I reckon. Oh. Actually, I won't go there. No. Oh! <laughs> no, 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 I was meant. To, I was meant to say this the other day. I, um, uh, a bird messaged me out of the blue, and she she watches the podcast, and she's not. She's all right. Oh, I've been chatting to her, and um, oh. and she like she wants to come up and like meet me, and I was like, oh, okay. get her on the. Let's get. Oh, no, dude, you, I, li I you like you I'm, like that she doesn't yeah, want to come no, on the podcast. But um, I mentioned that I mentioned. Oh, I said, why don't you just go on the Bachelor Brown? It'd be funny. She goes, no, I'm too scared. Like they yeah, there'd be so much. many scared bitches out yeah. there. So I think because that's after, your fault. And especially after the, the reading some black book <laughs> yes. entries. Yeah. You do it straight after you talk about a... a yeah, you're a, right. We should yeah. maybe try and separate those a little bit. That's a good tactic. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, next question is from Perseus. My noose is loose. Um, Marty, can you describe what it's like to wake up sweating in the freezing cold at 4am covered in wet shit? It was, uh, yeah, it was, it was, I came to and then like I felt, just remember feeling like cold, really cold. And then like I pull the blanket back a bit and I'm drenched in sweat, my upper body. And then I'm like, fuck's sake, I go have a shower, pull the blanket off. And oh, there is just shit in all in my fucking undies and stuff. There's just shit. Has everyone, Everywhere. I, I've shut the bed. Well, thank you, Michael. The bed? Thank you, Michael. Just uh, once in, <laughs> in Bali. Pissed the bed. No one else. Yeah, really? I haven't even pissed the bed. Yeah. yeah, I haven't actually pissed the yeah, bed I've either. never pissed the bed though. It's yeah. not normal. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, yeah, yeah. there'd be way more no, pondering. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone goes, yeah, yeah, no, I've showed the bed six or seven times. It's you doable. Still do it Once you start, yeah, it's happened. Like, really? Now when and you're then. sober or only when you No, drink. only when I drink. Yeah. 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 True. But like, I reckon. <laughs> Henry got into it for a bit. A friend of mine, once I started, he started getting into it, but then he grew out of it. But he's still around like, you know, 20 well, years you old. You haven't, you've what? You've done it once in like two years. I mean, something. like I can try yeah. it. Yeah. I can try yeah. it. Yeah. See how it and goes, like, you don't need to be asleep. Just stand on yeah, your bed I'm, and yeah, piss yeah, it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah I'm not that keen, but I know. Yeah. No, it's not good. And then fucking, yeah, there's, there's shit everywhere. And then I'm so cold in Brisbane at the moment. So I was fr it literally so hard to take a step forwards because my body was shaking so violently. <sighs> what, you had a warm shower? No, just wiped my ass and slept on the couch. <laughs> what did yeah, Mon true. say? Yeah, she was like, get out. Well, no, Mon, Mon wasn't there. Oh, Emma? she wasn't there. Thank okay. God. I would have been oh, Thank this God. This is real recent. Yeah, last week. Oh, <laughs> true. I've been, yeah, me guts have been all fucking gapped up, cunt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. All right. Uh, next question is from uh, Dundonian. Dundonian? Depending where they're from. From. Um, uh, when are you guys going to do the, uh, when when do, ali do aliens exist experiment? So when are we going to go out searching for aliens? Isn't that like in, uh, talking what about we say? Long? We said we were going to do it next week, but we're not going to do it next week. It's probably going to be in like not five next weeks. week. 
Five weeks or three. next, not next week. The week after, I reckon. Four weeks, two weeks. I'm going to say two weeks. We're just going to go to where this documentary was filmed, Australian Skies, and we're going to fucking camp out and see if we can find ourselves some fucking aliens. Come, you boys are welcome to come. Oh, you'll be in bloody Europe slamming prostitutes. <laughs> <laughs> But Jaden, uh, you can come okay. if you want, man. Bring some of your fucking meals, can't we'll throw them on the fire? <laughs> oh yeah, you could feed us all. We'll give some to the aliens, can't no we? Get intergala- intergalactic there, marketing. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Our camping trip. I still think about that. Like we got some fucking funny videos out of that what we did. Yeah. Poor, poor, <laughs> poor <laughs> Shami fucking we were too fucking hung Shami over and to Josh film anything. Cut us, <laughs> they were being so what did you get heaps of content? And we just got <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got so slammed. <laughs> we just remember, kicked every single window. In. Remember that guy? Oh, the guy the next morning kept coming to like, wanted to box me. Like, Come <laughs> yeah. on, big boy. Come on, big boy. I'm like, man, fuck off. I've slept like two hours. Really? <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, Why did that happen? I don't know. He's like, you guys into boxing? It's like real into boxing? <laughs> oh, I thought like he was angry at us. No, no. He was, no, like, he was yeah. just like, like, yeah. Don't know what that was. Like fucking dick showing competition. Oh, man. But yeah, that was a fucking wild camp night, man. Those it's- Asians and you just kept walking and no one is safe. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> saying it, I can't believe no they stuck around for that long. They so made the saying, fire for two us. Two or three of the <laughs> most innocent <laughs> little Asians you've it's ever seen. It's not safe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that is like the perfect scenario. So what you get warned about. Jeez. Don't, don't fo- like, especially if one of them saying that they're not safe, don't follow us. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, you shoo them away because you just want to like get even more slammed. <laughs> yeah. I lost three windows out of the four <laughs> <laughs> my car was ruined in the morning I was, yeah, like, yeah, like, what happened to my car I remember at one point I was rolling a joint in the car and I just like had this wine bottle shattered through the back window and glass goes everywhere through the car and I'm like oh my god I just could not believe Michael's it Michael's sitting in the car <laughs> like he's minding his own business in the car when I'm sitting here <laughs> fucking pegged a wine bottle through the back <laughs> And oh, every man. piss was in the back of your car. <laughs> and so you just, you're, you're, the back of the car was just flooded. Oh my just God. <laughs> God. The glass you everywhere. Piss, just you piss in the, ba- in the back window that you'd, <laughs> the window you'd broken. Oh. So you're just pissing in there every yeah, time. Yeah, that was every, like oh, the oh, urinal. Oh, 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 oh. Every time. Was and a urinal. bigger smash like, every time we went to piss too. Yeah, it's like fucking open fields everywhere, but we just <laughs> piss in the yeah. car. I forgot yeah. about that. And yeah, the doors same. were fucked. Oh, yeah, just kicking the doors in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we did some cow chasing. Oh, I wish. I wonder if I still got those videos. That was funny shit. Yeah, I wish. Yeah, that is a funny idea. They're scary though when you end They're up getting fast, close eh? to. Them. Yeah, they are quite fast. The There's no way you can get near them. So, but something hilarious about watching a fully grown man sprinting <laughs> after cows <laughs> or any animal. Michael fully shooed them across the road and shit yeah, oh, rapid, into, na- hey. into neighboring oh, paddocks. Rapid. It's my favorite animal. Yeah. Cows. <laughs> Thinking yeah, about it. Fair enough. They're kind of cute. All right, next question from Gavin S. Um, if you guys were to dispose of a human body, how would you guys do it? How would you hide the evidence? I think I'd um, get a, a drum and I would um, put the body in and I'd burn the fucking thing. I'd burn it and then once it was ashes, I'd snort the ashes, cunt. I'd fucking cut one fucking kilogram of cocaine with those fucking ashes, cunt. And I'd sell the prick on the streets. The DNA would be... Everyone's. In, body, though. in everyone's oh, body. okay. In everyone's body. And boom, the perfect crime. But they'd get back to you like probably making the coke. No, no, because I, I outsource that. Oh, okay. I know I can't. Okay. That's cool. <laughs> I just got to front the money, but that's it, can't. Is that Darren? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Darren's come out. Sorry. Um, How would you boys kill? <laughs> best way to kill someone and just hide someone. I haven't really thought about it. Fuck, probably just in the ocean, wouldn't it? Yeah, that's not oh, bad. Just ocean. go out I guess with some bricks. Effort, it's very mafia of you. Drop oh, them down. It? Oh, true. Some bricks or something. Yeah. Didn't I'll, you try that? Even just a river. Yeah, a river. Yeah. yeah. I'll put them on a concrete slab. Oh yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. Ty, oh, see, oh. see one which one's booked in. Go out to the address. I'd, I'd, I'd to worry that the concrete that's would crack or something. Sorry. That's, <laughs> um, yeah, he's, that book. Yeah. Oh, dude. 
<laughs> yeah, he's done so much sense. Eh? Perfect person to ask that question to. Yeah. It's a hundred percent success rate. Anyway, sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. Um, all right, next question is from Damon O'Dwyer. Um, how is Matt allowed in the Facebook group chat for the website if he isn't even a, a subscribing? Yeah, member? I know. I I, I I added him to the group because so many members talk about him, and I wanted him to see. And I thought, you know what? Since I've done such a nice gesture for my friend, maybe he might sign up to our website, our life's work. Speaking of website, we've come Fucking up with hasn't. some brown ideas. Brown yeah. idea? We've yeah, got some good of, videos to do yeah, with Instead you. of oh, yeah, blackjack. Instead of blackjack, brown jack. What with, happens? Oh, you'll see. Can't it's like okay. ca- casino. <laughs> We're being casino. Yeah. Oh, no. Brown jack. You understand? It sounds nice. Sort Some, of. Something's off about that. But yeah, we'll be gambling, which is cool, sort of. No, nah, no, nah, that's sick, man. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, there wasn't much in uh, questions today. Um, All right. Well, since you guys are thinking, how about this? What would you rather? What would you rather? Would you rather... Like, looks like such a redneck yeah. stoner cunt. Yeah. yeah, I feel like in character with the green he's, and he's green. He's been out fucking getting no, fish for his family. <laughs> shrimp. He's been out it shrimping. Right. Goes with that hair too. Yeah. It looks it's good. A, yeah, actually rate it. Thank you. <clears throat> it looks good. So, yeah. Would you rather bite your fingers off? You have to bite them off. Mm. You've only got 10 minutes to do it. That's one finger per minute. All 10. Yep. All 10 fingers. Oh, come up. All, 10 in all 10. All 10. Fingers. One a minute. <laughs> you have or, to chew and swallow the fingers? No, no, you just got to bite them off. Oh and my God. Them out. Actually, bite your finger and see how fucked that is. Oh. You'd have to just. Like imagine, you'd break your teeth. teeth. I don't think you could do it. Oh, yeah, you're right. It'd be too hard to, break, to bite through. Or would you rather. Um, be deaf and blind for the rest of your life. Fuck, man. <laughs> fuck. fuck. I'm biting my fucking fingers off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have to. Man. Oh, it would be so to. hard. Yeah, gonna have to. Imagine Just if get it done. you get one Just or two done and then you realise you can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> the pain kicks in and it's like, I can't. Deaf and blind. That's That's blind. Deaf and blind, but yeah. <laughs> Yeah, deaf and blind is rough. That's pretty much. You'd deaf. have touch. You could just sort of like get you groovy f- with shape, feel your oh, way through suck. life, and taste it. Oh, your ten sense yeah. of taste would be outrageous. You'd become like a restaurant. a chef, man. You become a restaurant. <laughs> no one could talk to you or, the, or like look at you though. You wouldn't know where you are. No, you just get fed heaps, and you're the, like the deaf, restaurant decider. Deaf and blind. Yeah, so you wouldn't even be able to comprehend what's happening. People would just be putting food in your mouth, and you'd be like, oh, and you just you, you yell out sounds of flavors that you like, and people write it down, and it gets like. That that's would disrupt how. the other eaters. No, but that's, yeah, true. Okay. All right, we'll think about You'd it. You'd get good at your taste if you didn't have your sight or your hearing. Yeah, that is so true. So, so let's do it. All right, let's do it. Right, let's, let's go. Yeah, more. Let's do it. Sorry. I was like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh. yeah. <laughs> All right, well, fuck it. Let's just do the prank call and just see what happens, oh. right? Oh, and a garlic bread and a drink, sorry. Right, yeah. <laughs> Hi, this is a How can I help you today? Hello, how are you? Um, yeah, look, I'm just. How are you? Yeah, not too bad, thanks. Um, I'm just trying to order online, um, and I'm putting in the uh, the uh, voucher code here, and it's it's coming up saying that it's an incorrect code, and I'm and I'm and I'm trying like I've I've tried three or four times. It's definitely the code that's written on the uh, voucher in front of me, and it's just not seeming to go through. So I'm just wondering um, what the go is there. Yeah. All right. Um. So what was. The code for? So it's for two large pizzas, right? Yep. Um, it's, it's got a garlic bread and a drink there. Yeah. All right, yeah. Yeah. What was the code that one? Okay, let me just get it out in front of me. Um, yeah, so. Yeah, right. yeah, so 535. Yep. 35. And it's just not coming up, and I've put it in over and over again. And um, to yeah, be honest, sorry. you know, I, I don't really have time to uh, be, you know, calling about calling store after store. I'm just sort of after some dinner for my for my family. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I get yeah, that. Yeah, oh, that yeah, it's quite frustrating. Numbers, yeah, right. So that's the issue: is that instead of there being five numbers, there should be six. 
Yeah, that is so confusing because the piece, piece of paper that's in front of me actually has five numbers on it. So I'm just confused. Um, you know, I'm just, it's, just, it's just confusing uh, to say the least, um, darling. And, and, and maybe uh, we could just apply the uh, voucher discount anyway since I'm looking at the voucher in front of me. Right, so unfortunately we're probably not going to be able to put that through just because... What do you mean, darling? I've got the voucher right in front of me. Yeah, I'm supporting small business. It's delivery. It's for pick-up, darling. Yeah. Pick-up? So that yeah. was two pizzas, of garlic bread and drinks to pick-up? Yeah, that's correct, yeah. All right, so I have one here for $26. That's that's correct. No, oh, sorry, mine says nineteen nineteen ninety nine. So, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure yeah. where they... I, I wouldn't have even bothered coming to Domino's if I'd have known that your vouchers aren't even valid. Um, yeah, so unfortunately, just, I don't know why there's five dollars in that code, voucher code. Yeah, it's, it's very confusing, yeah. I don't really know what's going on here, darling. Um, but do I. I'm quite confused about that too. I have no idea whether there's a five dollar voucher code, but we've never had, uh, not dollar, sorry, a five number voucher code. We've never had that. It yeah, has to be six yeah, dollars true. to put through though, unfortunately. Right, yeah, right, yeah. Look, l- l- listen, so, so you're telling me, right, that I'm not going to get the voucher discount on my meal tonight! I can put you into a manager. That would be great! I'd love to speak to the manager! Unbelievable. <laughs> Sit down, darling. It's okay. Mummy's just upset. Mummy's upset. Hello? Can you hear me, darling? Hey, it's the from the business. How's it going? Yes, I'm not, I'm not too bad, Look, we're, we're having a bit of a disagreement here. Um, Look, I'm reading out the voucher code, okay? It says uh, two large pizzas, a garlic bread, and a drink for nineteen ninety nine. And I'm reading out the code, and your employees are telling me that that is the ir- ir- incorrect code and that I am no longer allowed to have that discount. So, yeah, it's, it's a little frustrating, mate, yeah. Yeah, so what's the code on that one? Yeah, so 5 5. 5 3 1 5, yeah. 315? Yeah. Yeah, so it should be a six-digit code if it's a Domino's code. Yeah, that's that's exactly what your uh, employee said. But I'm, I'm lo- look, listen, mate. I'm looking at the piece of paper in front of me and I can see that there's clearly five numbers! Oh, he's hung up. <laughs> oh, 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 we should have said there was a sixth number. Oh, um, holy shit. Yeah, the ones here have five, but then I've found other ones that got six, so... It doesn't matter. What's done is done. Let them think. Let them think that happened for real. (laughs) She laughed and handed over. Was she laughing or like I couldn't tell? No, she was laughing. She was a bitch. (laughs) Oh, take that back. All Domino's employees use special places now. I can't tell them. (laughs) We love you. (laughs) We love you guys. (laughs) All right, guys, that is, is the end of episode number 22. Thank you very much, Jaden and Austin, for coming on the best podcast in the fucking world, boys. We got fucking stone, can't I? Eh? Would you <laughs> rather <laughs> listen to Blue <laughs> Dabba Dee Dabba Die uh, or I'm a Genie in a Bottle by Christine Aguilera? For the rest of your life, <laughs> on repeat. Do Dabba Dee Dee. I reckon you'd go insane after two weeks. Yeah. I, I reckon Genie in a Bottle would probably send you insane Fuck, too. I'd kill nah. myself with yeah. Genie in a Bottle. I reckon, um, because um, that song is already repetitive. Blue, Dabba Dee, Dabba Die, you could fucking just be like, all right, I'm just going to have that as my yeah. mantra. Yeah. Dabba yeah. Dee, Dabba Die. I reckon, <laughs> you just get into every moment of life. Yeah, yeah. But like, Genie in a Bottle would send you insane. No, no, you'd be like sexy. You'd walk with sex appeal. Yeah, you'd get song. a bit strange though. Yeah. Imagine when you get to like your 50s and 60s and 70s doing that. Yeah. <laughs> Genie in a body Always be whistling it Anyway um, Sorry Thank you for watching Don't forget to like Comment Subscribe Five star review And all that shit And do everything that we say Cause we're the best We're the best We're the fucking best We're the fucking best We're the fucking best We're the best Oh my god We're the best We're the really 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 best <laughs>